exposed. Jessica Mulroney reveals Meghan's greedy ways she stole royal funds to fund lifestyle. The author claims to have been a close friend and confidant of the Duchess of Sussex in the past. However, they say their friendship came to an abrupt end last year following a very public falling out. At the time, the author was discouraged from revealing too much about what really happened between them. But now, they have decided to reveal some of the Duchess's deepest secrets in a tell-all book called Finding Freedom from the Frenemy. The author portrays the Duchess in an unflattering light asserting that she was obsessed with fame and freebies from the start of their friendship. The author claims the Duchess loved nothing more than schmoozing with celebrities and getting comped luxury items and exclusive experiences. She loved the glamour and prestige that came with rubbing shoulders with the rich and famous, but allegedly had no money of her own to afford that lifestyle. The author alleges they were able to help open many doors for the Duchess through their own connections, but claims it always came at a cost. The Duchess expected favors in return, and these favors always seemed to benefit her directly without much effort on her part. As an example, the author says they were able to secure highly coveted Hamilton tickets for the Duchess, but she didn't lift a finger to help the author with their own work or charities. The author claims that once the Duchess started dating Prince Harry, things got even worse. They allege the Duchess had access to the royal family's money and influence, and would freely charge expenses to Prince Charles's accounts without hesitation. The author portrays the Duchess as seeing Charles as nothing more than a wealthy benefactor to fund her lavish lifestyle. Even after marrying into the royal family, the author claims the Duchess's love of freebies didn't stop. They assert that famous brands were desperate to dress and sponsor the Duchess, and that she played them all and took full advantage, never paying for anything herself. The author cites the Duchess's 2018 royal tour, where she supposedly wore over 80 outfits in just 16 days, claiming there is no way she could have afforded all of those designer ensembles on her own. The author alleges this constant desire for freebies created a lot of tension between Meghan and palace officials. They claim palace courtiers were appalled by her blatant entitlement and felt she treated the royal family's resources as her own personal piggy bank with no gratitude or appreciation for her luxurious life as a royal. The author says the palace tried multiple times to rein in the Duchess's behavior, but she refused to change and threw tantrums instead. Ultimately, the author claims this conflict over the Duchess's freebie obsession is what led to Megxit, the Sussex's decision to step back from royal duties. The author alleges that behind the scenes, the Duchess was pushing Harry hard for a full breakaway so they could cash in completely on their celebrity status through lucrative deals and projects. The author portrays the Duchess as seeing dollar signs and being desperate to monetize their brand. In summary, the author paints a picture of the Duchess as an entitled, fame-obsessed individual who ruthlessly exploited her royal connections and resources for personal gain, with little regard for propriety or gratitude. The author claims their tell-all book will reveal the truth behind the Duchess's public persona as a gracious, charitable Duchess.